establishing security. See you soon, Mr. Jensen. Rioters are tearing the city apart. On maintaining a safe environment and an ethical approach to research at all. seen the footage, but that not exactly a great day to be a Detroit citizen. I'd seen the footage, but that shit kicked off the records. These people are probably freaking out for nothing. I don't know if it's true. Augmented soldier story. I promise you, you will learn the fear of the mystery men. They're among us. Hidden. Training exercises for augmented soldiers? How did they think this was going to go over? Oh. I haven't seen the footage, so I'm not going to make any assumptions. Well, I have, and it's exactly what people are saying it is. How can you say that? It's so easy to doctor. You okay, sweetheart? Huh. Well, I'm a little shaken up, but I'm just glad we got off the streets. I almost shit myself when that group of cops came blazing around the corner. We were seconds from getting trampled. Sarif had me hack the convention center security logs for you. Sandoval signed out. He isn't there. Taggart will know where he went. You really think he'll tell you in the middle of a riot? In front of all the media? He will if I ask real nice. Well, if that doesn't work, he also has a dressing room backstage. Seems to me a man like Taggart must keep close track of his employees. This escalator had broken down this week. You think they would act as well? <clears throat> Bill is really changing the world for the better. We're changing it back to what it used to be. Yeah, but the secret of Ozzy just can't subscribe to Taggart's Neanderthal opinions. It's like he thinks he needs to be. Evolution is a fantasy, but that is exactly what I am telling you. As a world... Where's your sidekick, Taggart? Six months ago, Seraf Industries was attacked by mercenaries whose objective was to cripple our research. But I've learned the attack was just a smokescreen. Megan Reed's team was kidnapped, and Isaiah Sandoval, your personal aide, was involved. 
<laughs> that is ridiculous. Ladies and gentlemen, I apologize for Mr. Jensen's intrusion, and I assure you that these accusations are without basis. Are they? This is Sandoval. Why are you calling me here? There's been a change of plans. Seraph's team must not make it to the hearing. But that's too soon. If you want me to remove the GPLs, I'll need a full operating suite. Does the facility have one? That's your man, Taggart. Talking about removing implanted GPL devices so that the people who took Seraph's scientists could cover it up. I see what's going on here. Seraph Industries has received two black eyes in the last few days. The first due to the shocking news coming out of Montreal that biotech companies are secretly participating in unethical super soldier experiments. And the second as a result of their violent escalation of today's peaceful protest. David Sereth and his corporate bedfellows are desperate and in imminent danger of losing the regulation vote, so this man has been sent here to attack my reputation. I'm right here, Taggart. Look at me. I admit, I wouldn't feel bad if your reputation was damaged in front of the press, since you've been doing the same to my colleagues for years. But that's not why I'm here. Seraph scientists are alive, and it's time for the truth to come out. The truth, Mr. Jensen, is that this recording of yours proves nothing. It could have been made by anyone in the world with a grudge against humanity front, and you are our prime suspect. You're right, it's not enough to get a conviction. But it's enough for a search warrant. It's all I want, Taggart. Why are you standing in the way? I'm not. I'm trying to protect... Look, Mr. Jensen. I know why you came here instead of taking your recording to the police. I know the real reason for your accusations, and you're not entirely to blame for what you're doing. It is common after trauma such as the one you suffered, to fixate on the event, to stay blocked in the past. In a word, you're obsessed. I can worry about myself later. What's really important now is the five innocent people whose lives were stolen from them during that attack. Sandoval knows where they are. Now where is he? I... I don't want to see anyone's lives stolen from them. If you could see your situation clearly, you would realize you're being driven by your losses. Your actions are motivated by an attempt to regain a sense of control at my expense. You're turning me into your enemy when I'm not. I don't have to make you my enemy, Taggart. Your actions speak for themselves. You started the anti-augmentation movement, and now anti-augmentation terrorist groups are making headlines every day. You always say Humanity Front isn't violent. But look outside. We're seeing proof that it is. The violence is a terrible thing. I do not advocate it, but nor can I deny it exists. From the very day I founded Humanity Front, I made it clear that the group would be devoted to non-violent resistance. To deviate from this would mean dishonoring the memory of the very woman whose murder caused me to found the organization. Mr. Jensen, how can you possibly accuse me of doing otherwise?
What happened to your wife was tragic. But what's happening to Sarah scientists is going on right now, and you have a chance to do something about it. You have nothing to lose if Sandoval's innocent. And if he isn't, you can preserve your reputation by helping me. Why won't you do that? Because I... I... I just can't believe Isaias would be guilty of this, but... You're right. Whether he's guilty or not, I have to get to the truth. Marjorie would want it that way. Ladies and gentlemen, I apologize, but I'm going to have to beg your indulgence for a few moments more. If you will all please remain patient. I will return as soon as I can. Thank you. Mr. Jensen, I'll see you backstage. to research at all times. We invite critics and members of the UN to tour our facilities firsthand. They will find nothing but order, progress. Mr. Jensen, I appreciate you allowing me to deal with this in a more discreet manner. Save it, Taggart. You've wasted enough of my time as it is. Now where's Sandoval? He has an apartment he uses when in this city, on Grand River Road. He. Mentioned he was feeling very run down, so I can only assume he went there. I see. He's not an evil man, Mr. Jensen. If he's done what you say, it's only because of his brother, Ezekiel. A man you might know better as Zeke Sanders. Sanders? The man who attacked Sarah's manufacturing plant? I knew nothing about it until after it was over, and then I tried. I, I tried to convince Isaiah not to follow in his footsteps. Good job. Mr. Jensen, please. Isaiah has done so much for so many needy people. People suffering from implant rejection. Promise me you will deal with him fairly. That all depends on Isaiah. I... I understand, but please try. Detroit, Toronto, Mumbai, and Rio de Janeiro. All report violent This is important. Jensen? I almost didn't recognize you. Jesus, Mary, and Joseph, what are the chances? Do you remember me? Uh, I was a rookie when you still rolled in SWAT. Nikki, of course I remember you. How you been? The brass got you on ride control too? Yeah, yeah, I am. Or I was until... <sighs> Damn it. Look, something big is going down and I'm kind of freaking out here. You remember that MCB'er, Jacob White? You busted him a couple of times. Yeah, I remember him. Assault and possession. He's still running rackets. No, no, I mean, yeah, shit, I don't know. Anyway, it doesn't matter, because 
He's moved on to bigger things. Nikki, slow down. Listen, hear me out. I just got word he has his hands on some real military-grade explosives. The prick's got a fucking bomb, Adam. And you know how much he hates the PD. He's going to hit us while we have our pants down with the riots. You gotta help us out here. Nikki, I'm kind of busy. If he's got a bomb, just call it in and follow procedure. What do you think I've been doing? I've been on the horn all night, and my CO already sent a patrol over to Jacob's house. We've got a warrant, so they searched the place, but nothing came up, not even Jacob. Now they're saying my CI is probably full of shit and just fucking with me. <laughs> Bullshit! Jacob's using the riots as cover, and he's going to hit us, and hit us hard. Adam, I need you to trust me on this. You gotta help me find Jacob. Fine, I'll help. Let's go over what we know, just the facts. What we know? Just the facts? What we know is he's certified batshit crazy, hates cops, quotes Che Guevara, and got his hands on military-grade explosives. What more do you need to know? Oh, Christ, man. I've got nobody to help me and, and I can't even breathe. How am I supposed to find this guy? The bomb could be right under us, right now! Nikki, relax. Keep it together. I'm trying, Adam. I don't think I'm cut out for this kind of stuff. People could die. We could die. Just focus, okay? We know that White hates cops, so his first target is probably gonna be the precinct or somewhere nearby. Make sense? Yeah, okay. But it could be anywhere. He wouldn't risk going to the precinct. Too many people would recognize him. That leaves the transit station, the sewers, and the alleys around the precinct. Look, I need to stay here and report any leads to my CO. Can you check those locations for Jacob? Or his bomb? Got it. I know it's a long shot, but I'm hoping we get back up to expand the search. In the meantime, we can check those areas, and who knows, maybe we'll catch a break. Oh, and Jensen, please don't turn him into a martyr. I'd prefer him breathing. How may I be of service?
sure to tell all your friends. They're just not the cops. <laughs>
Access granted. I really appreciate you helping us out, Adam, but we're running out of time. We gotta find White before he blows something up. We're in the clear. I left White unconscious in the sewers under the precinct. Thank God. The Chief finally took me seriously and is sending some men to help out. We'll take it from here. Great. Anything else? Oh, and it isn't much, but take this. The cops have a Deadpool going. I don't like it, but you take down a cop killer and you get a bounty, that sort of thing. I usually reserve this to pay off our CIs, but I think you earned it. I threw in a little something extra for bringing him in alive. It's good to know you're still one of the good guys, Jensen. By the way, Nikki, White's bomb wasn't even explosive. It was a gas bomb. I managed to disable it, but you might want to get a disposal team down there to do a proper sweep and clean. Ah, uh, shit. I totally forgot about that. I'll get EOD on it right away. Last thing we need are more casualties. Man, I'm sure glad I bumped into you tonight. You're gonna have to let me buy you a pint down at Maggie's sometime. If I hang around you long enough, maybe some of that famous Jensen swagger will rub off on me. Yeah, we'll do that sometime. Take care of yourself, Nikki. Nora 92 to Central. Come in, Central. Over. Nora 92. That coat. Code 10 I called in earlier. It's actually gas ordinance. We need EOD down there for cleanup. Stat. Tell first response.
sure you closed the door? Yeah, yeah, of course I did. What do you think I am, an idiot? You're not gonna make me answer that, are you? The hell was that? You dead, like man. Trouble. Go ahead and run. I'm gonna get you up. You heard it? Richard, looks like Sandoval's got a secret bunker. I'm gonna flush him out. Let's hope he's still there. Here. 